Oh, uh, hello! Welcome! Now, I bet you're wondering, Joe, why are you looking so good today? But you're also wondering, you in your kitchen? What's going on today, Joe? <laughs> so I'm gonna tell you. This is Cooking with Joe, part two. Great. Basically, part one went so well. Did it? Okay, guys. <laughs> Let's mix. Just be careful when you mix in. Yep, and what do you need before you cook? Very important and very safe. Uh, I don't know. An apron. What an that? What's that? It's an apron. I don't know why it's so small. I don't know. Does it go there? I don't understand. Is it there? Let's put it in between. <laughs> Best of both worlds, half and half, just like a pizza. <laughs> Three, two, one, pop. No, it's too tight! It kind of feels right, but I, it's not covering up. I don't, I don't understand what this is. It says it was an apron. Oh! <laughs> oh sorry, that's just... Okay, okay, so your apron's on, you're safe, there's no splatter. And you're ready to make Pizza. I think you're missing ingredients. Missing what? Ingredients. Oh dear. Does it say how long it'll take to get to Tesco's? Five minutes. Five minutes, okay, thanks. <laughs> Didn't know you'd come with me. <laughs> now the one thing I forgot was the ingredients and all I got was a pizza cutter. <laughs> what are you doing here? I can't find a list. I left my notes at home. I don't know what I'm looking for. Puff pastry biscuits? It's either yeast or starch. I don't know which one it is. One of them makes your trousers go hard. And one of them makes pizza. I don't know. Oh, I forgot my blooming bags for life. Why is everyone looking at me? Look what you're wearing. You're in a bloody skirt. It's an apron. It's a skirt. It's an apron. But in the front it's a skirt. It's just half of an apron. Oh, you don't, you haven't been on cooking with you. you I've worked on bloody bake off. <laughs> it's ch chipotle flour, it's for making chipotles. What's the chipotle? This is it! Strong bread flour! Oh, that wasn't so hard, was it? Yeah. It only says one tablespoon, so we don't need. It's not important, is it? It's just one tablespoon. Uh, I think it's pretty important. It's just, we can just miss that. It's, just, mm, mm, mm. it's like when you make cereal, like yeah, you miss a cheerio. No. Okay. What is passata? Pasta. Pasta. I'm having a pasta pizza again. Passata. Is that tomato puree? Passata. Go find some passata. <laughs> Ingredients and sauces. That's the perfect aisle. Everything will be here. Oh dear. Where's the passata? He's upset because he's not getting pizza tonight. Passata? Passata? What are we doing down here? Um, just looking for more cheese. Okay. Um, so the first ingredient you need if you want to make a pizza at home, which all of you should, I don't know why, unless you put pineapple on it, do not do that. Don't do it. Okay, um, so the first ingredient is pasata. Where, where do we put that? What's that do? That just, this is the, um, it's just you put it on it. Tastes like pizza, doesn't it? The next one is a yeast. <laughs> if you'd asked me on a Monday, I'd said a yeast. This is a breed flour, cherry tomatoes. Grated cheese, uh, it has to be grated. Block cheese, let me tell you something about block cheese. Hey, last time I had a bit of block cheese, I came out me over renders two blocks. Couldn't stand up, couldn't walk for a week. Add another block of cheese after that. Don't know why I did that, big mistake, Joe. Came out as a bigger block. Why did it come out as a bigger block? And it matured. Don't even know what that means, but it didn't look nice. Piasto. And it says it just gives it that extra bit of pizzing. And you know what, we need a bit of pizzing. Pizzing! 
Sorry, I get excited because I just realised we're making pizza. I just found some ham. I mean, I didn't really have to go to the shop. I've got a lot here. Um, oh. Don't add that in. Oreos, yogurt, eggs and Nutella. So... Some what? Oh, sorry, ham. Um, just extra toppings. Yeah, um... I pour the flour into it. I'm just reading off my diary I made today just to remind myself. Um, right. Yeah, get over there. Wow. Just get under, stand over there. Stir in the yeast and the salt. You don't have to go back to the shop. Make a well. Make a well? Like a well from the grudge. We need to get bricks, cement, a field, landing um, permissions. <laughs> That'll do. <laughs> oh, oh. That's my hey, there's your flower. It's about five gram. Just put it on in there. I mean, you can't have enough pizza, can you? You want to get in there, probably make sure that the flower is settled. So once you know the flowers are in there, it's on to the next step. My eyes are on fire, my eyes are burning. Keep. Oh, this one. Is it all gone? Depends how big your tablespoon is. You know you go to beach in Scarborough with me and sometimes the sand gets a bit moggy at one half, I think it goes nice. We want that really moggy feeling in here. So if you're not sure if it's moggy enough, all you gotta do, pop your face in it. Now that is too boggy, if anything. Let's cut, cut to an ad break, yeah? We can't, it's, we can't. No, we're gonna cut to an ad break. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bob. Since I've used the cleaning slippers, my life's been brilliant. No more dust. That's what they should call them. Just free slippers. I use it down the corridors. Around the walls. Without the cleaning slippers, how would I clean? I can clean and walk at the same time. Welcome back. So once you've got your flour, you've got your yeast, you've made sure it's very, um, you know, rigid and ready, um, then all you need to do is find a wooden spoon, some warm water, and then what, we, what we're gonna do is... What, 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 are you, what are you doing? I'm making pizza. Do you mind? <sighs> Sorry about that. Um, get a wooden spoon, get some warm water, and then mix it in. So you need the water to be warm, but not too hot. That's cold at the moment. Getting warmer, and ah! We're just gonna use boiling water. It's only gonna cook the pizza faster, right? What does Luke water mean? Does it belong to Luke? Um, this is in flaws or fl dot oz. Then there's a bit of put next to it. What's put? I can't measure it in puts. Pints. Get in there. It also says add your olive oil, but again, cooking oil. It's the same thing. Um, so once you've done that, mix it all together. Oh dear. Oh, it's soft on oh, no, It looks like it did before. It looks worse. It looks like Scarpa Beach. Okay, so once you've done that, I mean, it looks different than it was before. So I'll say that's done. I have lightly and evenly floured my surface. Have a look at that. Um, don't stay too long on it. Pop on the flour surface. <laughs> and then it says knead for five minutes. Remember, two knees, five minutes. And you have to keep the knees going. If the knees stop, whoo, if the knees stop, careful, I don't know your underwear under this pin, eh? Um, hey, watch it, you. And if your knees stop, and there's no pleasing the kneading, keep kneading. Okay, I've got cramp. I think I've gone for this South Italian range. Just looks a bit, woo. Set aside for 15 minutes, because it will start rising, and you know it's whoa, up to the ceiling. Uh, it's a cover with a tea towel, and set aside. It doesn't feel right. Onto the sauce. Passata! Passata gets in my belly. Don't go crazy with it, just a little bit at a time. Okie dokie. Is that gonna be enough? For now? We're not feeding the family a ten. Um, I've just reread the diary and it, you do need a bit more passata. Um, Ooh, The Black Pearl. Just before we get onto the rest of the sauce, let's have a look to see if it's rised. Needs a couple more minutes, I think. 
Eggs in the go. That just really brings the protein into the pizza and onto my worktop. Make sure you don't get no shell in. It'd be disgusting if you had a bit of shell in it. Ugh. We've just got your protein, add in your chocolate. Oh, sorry. <coughs> Jeez. I had, um, yeah, I had some gone off kebab last night. Put the sauce to the side, just let it settle. Um, on to the next bit. Has the dough risen? Let's find out. Ooh, would you look at that? Look at all me do. I'm just consulting the diary. And it says if you've let the dough rise, which I have, give it a quick knead. Once you've kneaded your dough, you are gonna make a flipping pizza. So now you need a rolling pin. I haven't got one and I don't really want to use one. I think it's a bit old school. It's like saying, oh, Janice, do you want to go on MSN? <laughs> oh, I miss MSN. Sorry. <laughs> Lift it up. Just don't want that bit on it. Go on, off you get. Okay, we'll leave it on. Oh. Oh, um, sorry, just. Oh, um, round. This is my most favourite part of it. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add on the toppings. Can you put biscuits in the oven? Will they explode? Spray them out a bit, you don't want it looking silly. Um, so the yoghurt, I like to think of this as the icing on the cake. <laughs> uh, but it's yoghurt on a pizza. Yeah. I'm not going to add the ham, just because I physically can't open it. But I think it's alright, I think we're good for now. Oh, the cheese! Okay, so what I've gone for is the... Come down here, come on! Oh, is it... So we've got half and half. Um, half cheese and toppings, and the other half... Oh, leave it. it's just not cheese. Some people are dairy tolerant. Or something like that. Um, so, you know, I like to please everyone. And it's gluten free. Uh, is it? I don't think it is. Yeah, it's got, I didn't put any gluten in it. Mm. Pop it in the oven, max temperature, half an hour. Oh! <sighs> Sorry about that noise, I got a bit of oven heat then. <laughs> uh, things you can do while you're waiting for your pizza to be ready is um, magic. Oh! 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 Ooh! Ah! Where'd they go? <laughs> it's been about an hour, hour and a half, uh, time to bring that bad boy out. It's, it smells funky, I'm not gonna lie. Anyway, Sion! Hello. Tea time. Oh, so hungry. You're hungry? Yes. I'm Wait hungry. for this. Hungry. Stay there, my friend. Eh? Uh? I'm not eating that. It's got order, isn't it? Yeah, it's chocolate pizza. And Nutella. Sizzle. It's no, very I'm, good. I'm gonna order the takeaway. I'm sorry. It's got eggs in it. Protein. Sean. All right. Suit yourself. I'll serve it up for you. Uh, no, you go first. That's no, fine. You chef. Don't have chef always eats first. Yeah, but diner always eats before the chef. Second. It's got quite a squish to it. Go a bit with the Oreo. Okay, okay. <laughs> no need to pressurise me. <laughs> oh, it's got the yogurt inside it. Wasn't expecting that. It's a bit hot. I might have to wait a while. You no, don't. No. Have to... Oh, it's so nice! Mm. The aftertaste is, it goes on for quite some time. That's really nice. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save for there. Okay, what I'm gonna do. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. Oh. Sorry, that's the kebab again. I'm gonna save it for later and I'll probably make this backup one later as well. Um, that was That was actually gonna be the backup, but... You've been watching Cooking With Joe. If you want a comment down below what you want me to cook next... Uh, oh, oh, God, sorry. Comment down below what you want me to cook next. I can cook anything. I mean, I've just cooked two pieces. Hello. Uh, make sure you buy my cook... Up here. Make sure you buy my cookbook, available maybe, I don't know, 2020. Um, until then, have a great day. If you enjoyed the video, give it a small thumbs up. Um, you probably didn't, but if you got any entertainment out of it, give it a thumbs up. Um, and yeah, see you next time. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... You what? Uh, two pepperonis, one ham. Do you have any Oreos? Oh, that's not, that's not I'm just joking. Yeah, and bring them. Um, and I will see you soon, Nan. Yes, thank you. 
It's a top floor, thank you. Uh, and wedges, thank you, mate. Oh, it's my nan, she's, she's bringing me food.